ओके गाइस इट्स मी इमाद फ्रॉम नेल्सन डार्विन पार्क टेक यूट्यूब चैनल सो इन दिस वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल वी विल लर्न अबाउट हाउ टू मेक ए रेक्ट एंगल ऑन द जी यू आई ऑफ सी हैच सो हाउ वी कैन डू दैट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी नीड टू क्लिक ऑन फाइल देन वी विल क्लिक ऑन न्यू एंड देन ऑन प्रोजेक्ट देन ऑन विंडोज फॉर्म्स एप्लीकेशन ओके एंड देन क्लिक ऑन ओके now our gui is open in front of us now we will take one panel because uh, it's very difficult for us to draw directly on the what's called as the form so it is better to take a panel first make it a little bit big so that you can draw anything on it okay now we will double click on this panel and it will lead us to the call back of this panel a uh, function that is the private function so whenever or it will it it do not need any sort of friction to like uh, just like we used to do with push button or radio button or anything like that we just need to run the code and it will all these statements within this push uh, within this private function will get executed so we will write here pan b l k p e n so pen is one of the class and blk pen is our what's called as the variable it is called as the variable pen and blk that is black pen is our variable you can write anything here okay so this variable actually it will use to create a rectangle so how we can do that we will write new new pen okay new pen so this pen this new and this pen is function okay so they need to have some sort of parameters inside their parameter insertion bracket so what sort of attribute this pen this pen must have you you should have to write all of them within these brackets within these round brackets so we will write here color color dot f from argb from argb okay and then we will write this and uh, this comma 5 this 5 is the size of the pen okay that how much thick our or how much thick is our lines of this rectangle okay or the or the pen line okay so it is 5 and color dot from argb means that you need to red in you need to insert the uh, transparent red transparency first argument is for transparency that how much uh, it, it 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 how much transparent it is and uh, you you should ha also have to put the uh, value for red green and blue so we need to write here 255 means that there isn't any sort of transparency here okay you can put the value between 0 and 255 then we need to write the value of r uh, what's called as 0 value of green must be like 155 and blue must be 0 okay it's okay you, you can write any other value instead of these okay if you want to make it blue you can write 155 here and 0 here it is r g and b red blue and green okay so now after this is done we need to write e dot graphics graphics is our class which help us to make this rectangle and we will draw draw rectangle draw rectangle okay and e dot graphics dot draw rectangle now we we need to write this thing this variable comma 10 comma 10 why we have written 10 comma 10 because 10 represents the x axis position and 10 represents the y axis position and comma 90 comma 90 means that 90 is the length of the sorry width of the rectangle and this 90 is the second 90 is the height of the rectangle okay so we can do that like that so it is black pen b l k p e n comma 
10 comma 90 comma okay sorry 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 it, it, it there must be 210 okay 10 comma 10 and comma 90 comma 90 okay like this so so now we run it out you can see that we we have drawn our rectangle so can we move it can we make it a little bit more thick yes we can if we use write 15 here and if we use write uh, 390 here now okay 390 here okay so that it, it's it's width will get increased okay so like this so now this over like this so hopefully you got the concept that how you can make a rectangle within the c hash so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe